Paris is lovely and Nice sure is nice. And Marseille is charming with champagne on ice. But you stinky Frenchmen haven't a clue. You stinky Frenchmen, frog you. That being said, it's a cheese that I really love. It is the original orange cheddar. Now people are saying, Jeff, why don't you share with... Uh, with Mama Jeff, well, do you want some? No, because we went to his mother's house and after I drank so much this morning and then I feel like, oh my god. Oh, okay, you feel like, oh my god. So you see, she doesn't want and to And also, eat. I eat only cheese since two days. Only cheese. Because you did give me some... Why you give me so much cheese, Jeff? You're like a... Neil deGrasse Tyson. Is it like a blood for... <laughs> <laughs> no, 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 you cannot accuse celebrities here of rape. <laughs> this is the public space. Oh, so much no, cheese. no, you cannot defame anyone. This is what took place. These are the kinds of people hey, they are. This is that. what we have to arrest. Is that Mama JF? I thought I heard something. <laughs> Anyhow. I, had, I had I had to mute Mama Jeff because she was telling some mean things about no white guilt. I apologize. Mm. Uh, everyone who's a, who's a fan of the show knows that Mama Jeff has an uncontrollable and irrational hate of no white guilt, <laughs> and we don't hate her for it. It's just a brain spark that she has where she <laughs> construes no white guilt as someone else. All right, Lawrence Forbes says, Does Mama Jeff really have an issue with no white guilt, or is she just fooling around? She has an actual <laughs> issue. <laughs> don't, don't say anything violent. No, I won't. Okay, what do you have to say? No, I get seriously, you tried to kill me, okay? okay? And I'm fucking sick that you're fucking me with me. You always follow me everywhere. And, All right. <laughs> and you say you want to make spiritual movement, but you fucking tried to kill me for three years, okay? You're fucking okay. psychopath, man. Right. Okay, so the, the answer to the super chat is that Mama JF mistakes no white guilt for someone who has committed acts of violence against her. So that's why you see her currently sad. Mama JF has been the victim of an act of violence. This was not by no white guilt at all. She is confused and because she is confused, she associates no white guilt with People are asking on the regular chat, is Mama JF okay? Yes, she is doing good. I don't know if she wants to come to say hi, but she is doing good. So no worries for Mama JF. Hey. Hello. Hey, I just want to say, no, I will never accept your apologies, okay? <laughs> what you did to me was so mean. And this guy is not a real person. He's doing shape shifting. <laughs> and uh, he's a ghost. Don't believe him. He's not a real person. Okay. And you so, want to kill me. Okay. So, no white guilt is a ghost, uh, according to Mama JF. I will say, as a journalist, I have a duty here not to allow defamation. And I will say that uh, the theory that no white guilt is a shape shifting ghost is unsupported at the moment, in my view. All right. You, we have a question for Mama JF coming on the super chat. K. Max McDonald says, Mama Jeff, what is your background? What country do you derive your ethnic heritage from? Uh, I, can, I can answer that. Okay, but before, uh, I had um, a bad life, but then after I discovered GF, then I started to look at GF every day. I was always looking at GF. I became crazy. I lost everything I had. I lost my job, my family. I quit school. I lost everything. I was just looking at GF all the time. I was crazy. And then after I wrote to him, I said, GF, I want to suck your dick. <laughs> and then he told me. <laughs> and that's my background. You, 
you left you lost your job because you were addicted I lost everything you lost everything, everything because you were addicted job. to my shows <laughs> yeah, i was just looking at your show all the time even i had a, a job and I, w i was going to hide in the bathroom to listen to your show and i was <laughs> then my boss said why you always disappear for 10 minutes <laughs> Then you fired me. I lost everything, my family, my friends, everything, because I was just looking at GF show all the time. <laughs> You've never told me that. <laughs> yeah. Wow. <laughs> that is some dedicated fan right here. <laughs> that has anything to do with me being on the show. I am due four days a week, plus not with the flat earth thing. That is how the agreement was. That is. How See, Steve McRae was interested in the flat earth. Which is very naive and beautiful. Hello, Mama Jeff. Oh, you took your shower? Yeah, I was sleeping. Yeah, so... Hey, hello, AIU. Oh, yeah. <laughs> She's a big fan of AIU. Hey, uh, I just wanted to say, it's so nice what you do, but I don't know why you're atheist. Yeah, why are you an atheist, AIU? <laughs> yeah, why? <laughs> oh. Yo, hey, hey, me, I believe in God, le. Do you know how I did that? How did you reach a belief in God? Uh, it's because before I met GF, I was smoking a lot of weed, and after some time, God started to talk to me in my head. <laughs> <laughs> it's real. <laughs> I think that atheism is unstoppable. Will not be convinced by this <laughs> argument. Okay, <laughs> <laughs> All right. You stinky Frenchman, frog you.